Right, wrapping these here, Marcus. Um, get yourself about 10 feet of paracord. You'll probably have a wee bit left over. I'm not going to unwrap these and wrap them again because it does take a while to get them right. Take you about 15 or 20 minutes. You get a loop, you start on the cup here, you put the loop through. Then you pull both sides through that, right, pull that tight, and then what you do is you put both them back through so they're kind of pulling, pulling against the loop if you know what I mean, just through, right, now that would be it start it only it's a bigger version because it's on top of what I've already done so take it out again that's it basically put your lip through the inside of the cup pull it down tight and then feed them two strands back through there then what you want to do when you have that done is have it even as well so if you cut 10 feet have 5 feet this side and 5 feet this side and then each strand is going to do each side of the frame so you'll go right up there 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 wraps that's what, that's what it took me anyway and then come across and then down there right down there and then you can cross over and then I've woven that one but this one, I've just went down each side, and that's actually, I actually prefer the look of this one. Um, this this one here is not even the flip kung one, this is a core that I've just um, sort of sanded the tips. But it's the same thing basically, but that one there, you've got the pinky. You can use that, or you don't have to use it if you don't want to. But it's a nice wee option. That's another thing people always ask me about the Maxim Chumps. They don't like them because they've only got 18mm tips, they can't put wide bands on them. But I just, they are actually 35 to 25 tapers. And they're just tied at the pouch the same way over the top bands are tied and folded at the fork tip. Um, folded bands are shit for shooting over the top in my opinion because see the way they're kind of sitting like an open envelope. So it kind of... It's not good for aiming over the top, but CTTF makes no difference whatsoever. And that's how I've shot, always shot with them, and it's never given me any problems. I've shot really accurately with one of these. So I hope that helps you, mate. I just double wrap the end as well, and there you can see the little burn. Now that's actually the first wrap I've ever had on it. I don't think I'd ever take it off. Red and black. But yeah, that's it. Just start off in the cup of the fork with the loop, pull it through and pull it back on it itself like that. And then feed this side through there and that side through there. And each side gets wrapped individually. And then you'll cross over here where the little join is in the frame. And then you can either do it that way or that way. Alright mate, I hope that helped.